Are you tired of applying to developer job and hearing nothing back? I have been there too. But guess what? In 30 days, you can land your first dev job even with no experience. Who am I to share this? With over 15 years in technology and cracking interviews at IBM and with London's top fintech companies, I will show you exactly how. No confusing advice, just clear steps that work. But before I start, let me highlight this roadmap is for those who already know how to code but can't get the job. If you are still learning how to code or struggling in learning how to code, this video might not be right for you at this time. But if you are ready to land your first job, let's crush this together. Day 1-7 to seven, Fix your resume and LinkedIn Most people skip these first 7 days and that's why their resume get ignored. Let's fix yours so recruiters beg to interviews you. These 7 days are about proving that you can do the job even if you have never worked in tech. No fancy experience really needed. When Sarah, a teacher, switching to coding, applied with just coursework projects, she got zero calls. But after following this roadmap, just after 7 days, 2 interviews. How? She showed skills instead of telling. And here's step by step breakdown. First few days spend on auditing your resume. Delete old or part-time jobs or info that does not help or does not add any value unless they show you leadership skills. And add 2 to 3 points about your tech skills. Example, skilled in JavaScript or skilled in React or skilled in Git. And then add the right keywords. Find 3 job descriptions for your dream role. Copy words they are using like React APIs, Agile Team or Debugging. Add these exact words to your resume but only if you know them. Try to be honest. And then fix your LinkedIn. Add a project section and write 1-2 to two lines about each project. And finally, use a proven resume template. Download a simple, clean template and use it. No need to reinvent the wheel. And this is really important. Make sure it's easy to read and works with job portals. ATS friendly. Why? Companies use robots called ATS, Applicant Tracking System, to scan resume. And fancy design confuse them. Your resume is not a history test. It is a movie trailer. Show them the best in 5 seconds and then they will want to see more. I have seen many beginners skip projects. They just keep taking courses. That's why they never get hired. In the second week, you will build real things, even if they are really simple. Employers really don't care if you are self-taught or a university graduate. They care if you can code something useful, if you can add value to the organization. Okay, imagine two people applying for the same job. One is saying, I know JavaScript. And the other says, I built a weather app using JavaScript. And here is a link. Now guess what? Who will get the interview call? Of course, second one. So here is the plan for second week. Start with building simple but impressive projects. For example, weather app. Use a free API, shows you can work with real data. Or a to-do list, proves you know basics like JavaScript. Or maybe clone a site just the front page. These are just examples you can build any simple but impressive projects. And then, then put this project on GitHub. Clean code, no massive files, organize folders properly. Then write a readme file explain what the project really does and how to run it. For example, a weather app that shows 5 days forecast built with React and Open Weather APIs. And then make a portfolio website. Use GitHub pages which are free or Wix easy drag and drop interface and try to show about me page and projects with screenshot and with links and try to add your skills for example javascript html etc you don't need fancy project just proof that you can build and by this week try to build three projects and a portfolio by just doing this you will be ahead than most applicants so you are already ahead in the game most people blast their resume everywhere and hope for the best but that doesn't work in third week apply strategically. This step is about being smart with how you apply. You don't have to apply to 100 jobs. You just need to apply the right ones. It is about applying smarter, not harder. You will focus on jobs that actually hire beginners and learn to stand out with simple tricks. And here is how to do it yourself. Apply daily but do this instead. Use job filters like entry level, junior level, 0 to 1 year experience. Only try to apply jobs posted in less than 24 hours. And after applying, send this LinkedIn message. Hi, Hari manager name. I just applied for this job at your company. I built projects with tech skills. I would love to contribute to your team. Thanks. And then your name. 
it shows effort. And this short message also help you to stand out from the crowd. Remember this, getting hard is not about luck. It is about effort plus smart moves. 10 focus application is better than 100 random ones. And finally, why this works for you? Companies ignore generic resume, but, but if you show your projects and ask directly with the short message which I shared with you above, they will notice you, even with zero experience. And once again, you can download it from the link below in the description. And finally, in the final week, prep for interviews and close the deal. The final step is all about preparing your mind and your answers. So you don't just get interviews, you win them. You have already done the hard work by building projects and applying. Now it's time to show you belong to the company. Practice telling stories about your projects using the STAR method, like how you notice a bug in your application and how you fix it. Talk out loud, even to your dog or cat. Try to do some fake interviews on free apps. You might mess up at first, but in your second or third attempt, you will sound like a boss. If you finish strong, your first developer job is just a days away. Keep going, you are almost there. And here's a bonus tip, especially if you have zero experience. Think of your job hunt like a triangle. You can land a job by making any two of the three corners strong. But if you work on all, you will get results even faster. So this is the corner one, project power. Build something small but real. For example, redesign a local business, of course with the permission, and add it to your portfolio. This shows you can solve real problems, even without job experience. And the corner two is smart application. You don't need to apply to 100 jobs. You just need to apply right ones. Try to apply early and try to apply in small companies. They have less competition and they are more open to junior developers. Corner three, how you present yourself. This is all about your resume, LinkedIn and the way you talk about your journey. It matters a lot. And remember this. Good communication beats perfect code. Share your story clearly, whether you are a college graduate or a career switcher. And here's a pro tip. Start with one project and everything else get much easier. So there you have it, your 30-day roadmap to land your first job fast. You can download the 30-day roadmap PDF from the link in the description. You now know exactly how to fix your resume, ace interviews and stand out even with zero experience. If you're thinking bigger, like working at top global organization, this video is for you. Here I will break down what I learned from spending three years trying to get into UN. So, so you can shortcut that path. You have got the tools. Now, keep going. Your dream job is closer than you think.